now, El Paso County is having a celebration of life to honor those we have lost in the Walmart mass shooting and in Uvalde as part of the Dia de los Muertos event. KTSM 9 News reporter Tani Davis is live at Ascarete Park where the celebration is happening and tells us how this holiday is important for us here in our community. Natasia, today members of the community are gathering and honoring victims of gun violence on a day we remember those who have died. Now, El Dia de los Matos originated in Mexico but has grown across the U.S. Families place up altars with pictures of loved ones along with their favorite treats as a way to honor their memory. This day is also a way to celebrate your family's history through generations of people who have passed this along. Carmen Gomez, a counselor from EPCC, says we should honor the life we have every day and tomorrow is not guaranteed. Today we are celebrating them and who knows next year, maybe my picture will be there. You know, <laughs> you never know. But it's something to keep in mind, the, to, to um, appreciate the fact that we are here today because nobody has guarantee the next day. Today at Escada at the Park, they will be honoring the victims of the Walmart shooting and at Uvalde as a part of today's Dia de los Muertos celebration. Senator Cesar Blanco believes this is the perfect day to remember the lives lost as we not forget the lives they have lived and continue to honor their memory. I think for uh, a lot of the, the victims, the family members uh, here in El Paso and Uvalde, I think it's an opportunity to, to honor their lives, uh, to continue their memories, to, to continue the love that, and and wonderful memories that they provided us while they were alive and to carry, the, carry, carry those forward. The altar to honor the victims will be here for people to pay their respects to them or anyone else that they may have lost. Live from South Central El Paso, Tony Davis, KTSM 9 News.